Welcome to another segment of Under the Microscope. I'm Jeff Gold, and I'm so pleased to be joined today by uh, Dr. Kyle Meyer. Uh, Dr. Meyer is the Senior Associate Dean of the School of Allied Health Professions, which uh, is very soon going to become the College of Allied Health Professions. And I wanted to take a few minutes to discuss with you and with our audience today the significance of that transition. So would that be okay? That'd be great. I appreciate you having me. I thought maybe with your permission we might turn the tables a little bit today. Okay, I'm had, up for it. Uh, are you up for it? Okay. I've yeah. had uh, several people over the last several months ask me about the value of the school transitioning to a college. I know that's certainly going to be part of your legacy here at UNMC, and you've done so much to shepherd our proposals through these two uh, approval processes. So I thought maybe you'd like to tell the audience today why you think it's important for us to become a college. Well, we could spend a long time talking about it, but I'm, I'm very pleased to share some thoughts at least. Uh, First, uh, the, the history of the founding of the school, the diversity of the Allied Health programs, the excellence of the faculty, uh, the growth in the world reach of the school in, uh, across the country but also around the world are all markers of the fact that what it now is is more than a school and, and truly of a college level. But I've had other uh, motivational factors as well, some of which I've shared with you mm -hmm. and with the Board mm -hmm. of Regents, is that the national and global recognition of a college uh, is different than that of a school. It is uh, certainly higher. The prestige at the level of national organizations uh, and, and memberships in national organizations, the ability to continue to recruit and to attract and retain mm -hmm. the highest no. quality faculty, I think, I think is different. Yeah, I agree. Uh, I think students will notice a difference also. I think that they'll have a, a different sense of pride and a, a different sense of recognition as being part of a freestanding college mm -hmm. of UNMC. I've heard you say too that uh, the, uh, as we become a college, the value of the degree for our alums will go up because we'll have a greater national recognition. I think that's a really uh, great insight. Well, thank you for bringing that up because as I've traveled across the country and met with numerous alums, they're well aware of this transition pending and they're very enthusiastic mm -hmm. about it, which uh, actually is, uh, sort of brings up the thought of another important consideration is that I think from a philanthropic community and business support mm -hmm. perspective, the autonomy of a college is attractive mm -hmm. to some of our major donors in this community we certainly tested the concept with them and they Absolutely. seem to be attracted to it as well. How do you think that uh, becoming a college will help UNMC and Nebraska Medicine fulfill its mission to, to lead the world in uh, transforming lives for a healthier future? Well, uh, one of our major initiatives is interprofessional education. And there is no question that all of the allied health professions work very closely with uh, graduates of our nursing school, mm -hmm. pharmacy, dentistry, mm -hmm. medicine, uh, and all of our public health programs as well. As time goes on and we collaborate more on the delivery of health care, having that type of tightly knit relationship is incredibly important. Mm -hmm. Creating a, a closer knit relationship is going to be part of the way we will lead the world. Mm -hmm. You know, for could wax uh, on this for a long time, but the long and the short of it is we have educated healthcare professionals in silos uh, for decades, for generations, quite successfully. But as care is no longer siloed and it's much more collaborative, the education programs have to become collaborative and hence the integration of the allied mm -hmm. health programs is critical. Very good. Well, I appreciate you uh, t letting me turn the tables on you and we appreciate your insights and your support. We should tell the uh, listeners to the audience that on July 9th, at the 10 a.m. we'll be having a celebration, campus-wide celebration, mm -hmm. to recognize our transition, which officially occurs July 1. Uh, that is at 10 a.m. in the Ruth and Bill Scott Student Plaza. So we want to invite all of the campus to join us for that event. Well, we look forward to seeing you there, and we look forward to seeing many members of our campus community there as well. Thank you so much for being You're with welcome. me on this segment of Under the Microscope, and thank you.